Hey guys, welcome back to Plan with Ness. And if you are new, my name is Vanessa and I share with you all things planning and stationery. I just want to let you guys know that um, I greatly appreciate all the followers that I have gained. Um, I am very grateful. And if you have not subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe. Um, I post videos Mondays and Fridays and occasionally Wednesdays. Um, so before you leave, be sure to like, subscribe, and turn on that notification bell so you know when I post my videos. So in today's video, we're going to go over my January kit lineup. I apologize for the lighting. Um, the sun is starting to come out. It's very snowy outside. It's beautiful, um, but it is um, foggy. So I am, I was like, well, I need to film. So this will have to do. <laughs> so let's get through it. So uh, um, first things we're going to, throughout the months, I will pull out from these two reusable sticker albums from Orange Umbrella Co. Um, so this one, I call it my junk drawer. Um, it's just a sticker book that I have like a bunch of random stuff. This is, um, I have, I haven't organized it. And then this one I just bought during, um, the TPC sale that Orange Umbrella Co. participated, participated in. And, um, I also purchased these dividers from Samantha Rose stickers during her Black Friday sale. Um, so this one I started organizing. Um, so this one definitely will be using in January. It has my student teach IEP stickers. And then it has like my school, any of my school homework scripts that I need. So I will be pulling from these two. And I also will be pulling from my freebie sampler um, sheet from Planner Kate, so I have a bunch of this stuff. And um, I also have the, the new Erin Condren um, sticker book for 2023, the months, so I have that. This most likely will go in my journal, um, or maybe, I have no idea where to put this yet, so it'll come to me. So we have that, and this is an Erin Condren um, sticker book. And then here are my kits. Um, this is from Planner Kate. So let's see, I'm gonna pull them out. I should have been prepared, but hey, that's the fun of it, huh? <laughs> um, so we have that. Hold on, I wanna make sure. I keep these in order. Um, so we have that. So how are you guys doing? Are you guys um, enjoying the holidays so far? Getting ready for them. Um, one second. Those. I'm going to go off really quick and pull them out. Okay, guys. So here we are. Um, this is my January monthly kit. This will be my first time using a monthly. So this is kit 501 from Planner Kate. So I have sheet one and sheet two. And I also purchased the dashboard. I do not know how this will be used. I've, I'm not really into using my dashboard. Let me show you guys. So in my current planner, or just in general, like November, I just kind of put a picture. This is my cat Tater. I put a little, I am doing my best on a piece of washi. Like, oh yeah, I'm going to do something and I never did. And then for December, I don't have anything. So I'm not sure how I will use it, but um, maybe this will give me some motivation to get it going. I'm not sure. So we have that, and then we have this for the first week of, so it'd be December 26th through January 1st, um, kit 400, the headers and the weekly sampler. During Planner Kate's, so I purchased all of this during Planner Kate's, um, 
her Cyber Monday, it was like 40% off. So I thought that was a really good deal. And the weekly sampler for the new um, 2023, like New Year kit was already sold out. So I went to the previous year. So I will be using this for the week of December 26. And then the way I know the weeks is Planner Kate also had these, um, has these like stickers. So then I will be using kit 504. So I purchased the headers and then I have the weekly sampler. I love her new layout of, and the new script of her for the updated year. Look at those cute little sweaters. And like, look at these little, are those tree? Those are like mountains, I think. And it says like burr, really cute. So I have that. And then I have the large scripts. I think these are a lot of fun. And then I purchased the full boxes. So we have both of, we have all four of those for that week. And this says like, let it snow. Snow days are the best days. And then for week January 9th through January 15th, I have kit 046 from Hand Can Plan. This is sheet A. How cute is this? Look at the bears. And then um, we have the full boxes. It's I just love her artwork and her handwriting. And then we have the um, scripts and icons, so sheet D. So there's that one. And then we have weekly sampler kit 501. So we have the date, the date headers. And this is for January 16th through the 22nd. Follow your dreams so they know the way. So um, I went for a very like blue theme, like for winter this month. And then I also had the large scripts and the full boxes. And I just noticed when I was looking at these more closely, the 504 and 501 large scripts are very similar in color, just if you can tell the difference. So I am a little bit bummed about that. I wish I would have paid more attention because in case I didn't use something here, but either way, I can still use them. They will just end up in my reusable sticker albums and they will be used. So we have that. Make sure I put these back so I have their order. And then we have this kit for January 23rd through January 29th for more plans. So we have like the scripts and icons 22E. And then we have 22A, the main sheet. So pretty. And then the full boxes. Look at that flower. So we have that, and then for the last week, I figured for the week of January 30th through February 6th, we kind of start transitioning to February. So we have Hand Can Plan Kit 047. So we have sheet A and um, the sheet D and then the full boxes. So I really like this um, saying, pieces found was in. So yeah, guys, these are my kits for the months of January. I really wanted to um, try to put together a full month that went really well together when you look back on it. Um, we will see how it goes. I don't know if I'll change my mind on the week, but I am these the reason why I purchased the album and then these stickers is to really ensure that I do follow it. Um, just that stability there so that every week I already know what I'm using and I'm not stressing about like looking for something or trying to put together something. Um, it might happen, who knows. But I am very excited for my kit lineup and I can't wait to show the plan with me. So be sure to, as I mentioned, thank you for um, subscribing. So be sure to like, comment, comment um, your 
one of your favorite holiday movies. It could be either something spooky like Halloween or um, The Grinch. Um, so yeah, guys, thank you and remember to be kind.